Hi everyone and welcome again to another video. So after the unusually sunny and pleasant weather we've been having here in the UK recently, I think it's a perfect opportunity for me to introduce to you a really simple yet delicious Japanese salad dressing. This dressing is extremely easy and quick to make and consists of only a handful of ingredients. Today I'll be serving it with a tomato and shallot salad, but it will also make a great dressing for any salad leaves or vegetables. Like always, hope you enjoy watching the video. Let's crack on. The tomatoes I'll be using in today's recipe are these beautiful and vibrant cherry tomatoes. But of course, any other tomatoes can be used. Start by picking the tomatoes from the vine. Next, using a knife, score the top of the tomatoes and place them into a bowl or pan. Pour enough boiling water over the tomatoes so that they're fully immersed. After around 5 to 10 seconds, drain the contents into a colander. Then rinse with running cold water. Finally, peel the tomatoes and store in the refrigerator. For this recipe, either a shallot or brown onion will be fine to use. Remove the stem, peel, and then slice the shallots finely. Next, Finely chop some shiso leaves. Alternatively, you could use other herbs such as parsley, coriander, tarragon or chervil. To make the dressing, pour 3 tablespoons of oil into a container. You could use a vegetable oil, but I prefer to use an olive oil. Add 1 tablespoon of regular dark soy sauce. Add 1 teaspoon of balsamic vinegar to the container. This step is optional. If you choose to omit the vinegar, Simply add some more lemon juice. Mix thoroughly to combine. Place the tomatoes on a plate. Scatter the discs of raw shallots. Place the thin strands of shisa leaves over the tomatoes. Season with some salt. Grind some black pepper over the tomatoes. Next, give the dressing a quick mix before pouring over the salad. Finally, squirt some freshly squeezed lemon juice over the salad. Alright, so here we have the completed dish. So if you come down here, I'll show you exactly what it is. So you don't have to use these ingredients for the salad. Any salad will do, whether it's tomatoes, cucumbers, lettuce leaves, whatever. Dressing is fantastically versatile. So we've got the skinless cherry tomato with the beautiful disc of shallots. We've got the shiso leaves, which is actually part of the mint family. So place that on top. You can see the crushed peppers on top, it's lovely. The sea salt. Okay, I'll just dip that into the sauce a bit more. Itadakimasu! Mm. Really good. Mm. These shallots bring a lovely crunch. Beautiful olive oil, balsamic vinegar, the soy sauce, and the crushed black pepper gives a slight heat to the dish. It's a very light dressing. It's quite refreshing. Got balsamic, slight sweetness from the balsamic vinegar. Got the lemon juice brings the acidity, a bit of tartness to the dish, and the saltiness from the soy sauce. They work perfectly together in harmony. My mother's been making this salad dressing since I was a little boy. And I eat this at home with my wife and child at least two times a week. Normally with some salad leaves, some tomatoes, cucumbers, some raw onions and some tuna as well. Some canned, just tin tuna, regular tin tuna. And this dressing works perfectly together. I think on this channel I focused mainly on meats and quite hearty dishes. But I do love vegetables and salads. And I have a salad at least, or every day. Thanks for watching everyone, 
And as always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Until next time. Bye bye.